together. Sure. Because the reviews often say it was easy to put together. Well, how often do you hear that when it comes to patio furniture? You rarely hear that. But it's super durable. It is weather resistant. It can be a bench or a table. And yeah. many, many of you buy two of them because if you buy two, not only do you have a conversation area, but you can fold them down and put them together to make a picnic table, as Yogi Bear would say. Or a half a picnic table, right. which I just gave you right now. If so you're working on your laptop. So a lot of people laptop, put this up against their deck railing really, yeah. and kind of look out into the yard right. from that side of the bench. That's right, you can sit down on this side uh -huh. of the bench now, do whatever work you need to, maybe the kids are eating something. Again, up against the fence, such a great idea, Carol, yeah. because you can watch what's going on. Often our benches are facing the house. We're looking at the back of the house. And then within one second, it turns into a traditional bench right. that will hold, get ready for it, 800 pounds. So this is not wibbly wobbly. It is super durable. I've had mine out since last spring, Me too. all through the summer, all through the fall, all through the dirty stuff falling on it from outside. It's in the wooded area of my yard. And now it's been out through all the ice and snow. It still looks just like this brand new. And that is the beauty of it. This is not the, the stuff you see at the checkout counter. Right. This is a poly vinyl that will wear for decades and decades. It's meant to stay outside. You never paint it. You never paint it. You'll no never get no splinters. Nope. No it's rust. Great. And I'm going to show you how it's got a footprint on it that when you put it anywhere, whether it's on sand, whether it's on mud, it's not going to dig in. We always talk about the people at the barbecue. They sit down in a chair and the one leg goes in. They go yeah. flying oh, over. Oh, well, we gone. did that once at an ice cream <laughs> shop. Super you told me that one. That's exactly right. So let's look at the colors because we started out with simply white, which was always very popular. But last year, we brought in two new colors, which both sold out early. Yeah. So if you got one of these last year and now you'd like a second one so you can do the picnic table, come on in. We have the tan, the, the complete tan back in stock. Right. And then over here is the one that's always the most popular. Well, it's quite, it's quite dashing. Can in you this. see it from this shot? Okay, we're going to do a different angle. Um, this is the two tone. So it has a couple of the sections of white yep. uh, splitting up the tan. And everyone loves this, and it's been sold out like forever. So we have it back today. I you love know, it. You know what it is? It's really a mixture of both colors, but it gives you that splash of that crisp white, which will stay white. Any white furniture you have, yeah. you know you're looking to paint it every year. Well, and it doesn't even get up, grass stained. You've got the bench. Oh, the, anything. My guys are out weed whacking around it, and they're pulling it around the, the lawn to get it out of the way of the tractor mower, and it just always is pristine. Absolutely correct. And right up front here, I just want to show you, I was playing with some crayon. I have some mustard and ketchup somewhere I didn't get to, but this is the kind of stuff I just want to show you. It's been used in the LA County School District for 12 years, yeah. and they keep buying more and more every year because it works. And all you're going to do is when somebody comes with some crayon, or there's mustard, or there's ketchup, or you spill your coffee, you're just going to wipe it up. It, wow. lo it looked that way year after year. This bright white against the green of the grass and is nothing better. The same thing goes for pollen stains. They don't stick. Birdie do. That doesn't stick. These are just a fabulous material that these are made out of. Virtually indestructible. Yep. And the assembly is super easy. Isn't the it? assembly is really the sides. We added stickers this year. One side says left, one says right. Great. And all you do is put the panels in between and four bolts and you're done. It's literally five to eight minutes. But this construction, there's a lot of science in here, Carolyn. See this A-frame on the side? Mm -hmm. This is what gives it the stability. You're not gonna flip over on the converter bench. This right here lets you hold 800 pounds and look at the size of that footprint. It's not gonna dig into the mud. You can use it on sand. Well, how many things do you know that you can put on sand? Very few, because they dig in and they start to sink. Then when I flip this around, you're gonna see these ribs down here. Kind of looks like something from a bridge underneath. Uh -huh. So when you see those, those struts there, that's what allows you to hold 800 pounds. And when you talk about stability, yeah, I have been told I'm not the most stable person in the world, but you know, I wouldn't do this, seriously, I wouldn't With do this benches, on any, thank goodness. I, I, I don't say you should do this at home, but you can see the bench is not moving. I'm yeah. trying to move it back and forth. And Jeff is a big guy. He I, I, truly, I'm, uh, this would hold, did you say three David Venables or four? I, I believe it would hold three David Venables. At yeah, I'm, I'm just short of 6'4", 235 pounds. So yeah. you get an idea how it's ample for me to sit down. It's great as a bench. So here, now watch. You flip it up and you have a table. And watch how easy it is to make let's a picnic table if you get two. You want to go this way? Flip it, yeah, let's go. Okay. Anyway, okay. go ahead. Carolyn. Look, ta-da. Ca Carolyn just made a picnic table. This is exactly how it's set up in my yard. I yeah. have a lot of benches and other seating, so I just leave this 
as a picnic table all the time. Right. And it looks charming. It's not just because, oh, it's easy to put together and it's durable. It looks so nice in your yard. It, because you know why? Maintenance free. Yeah. There's no rusting of metal that you get, uh -huh. no warping of wood. Yeah. There's going to be no rotting of the wood. Yeah. And there's no painting and there's no staining. There's no splinters. There's just enjoyment. Once you get it home, you do nothing to it, but leave it's it outside awesome. and enjoy it year after year. Can you see how shiny and glossy this is? It stays like that. And yeah, it does. again, super easy to put together. You're not going to spend an entire Sunday afternoon trying to assemble this. It's so easy. And then when you're done, there's never any painting. There's never any anything that you have to do. You don't have to go around tightening screws or anything else. How much outdoor furniture has been such a hassle in your life? Most of it, probably. It, it really is. I said it, this it, morning. It I'm only looks nice when it's new, and then you got to do so much work to keep it looking nice. I'm looking out at the deck going, it needs to, I should have done it last year. Yeah. So it's two years gone by. It needs to be sealed or else it's going to start rotting away. It's inherent to wood. It's what it does. This is a product that will last year after year. And it's made to last, it weighs 38 pounds. So it, like I said, I don't want you to think this is that same material you see at the checkout counter. It's not. Let me also mention, you don't have to figure out where to put this and store it yeah. in the winter. Just leave it out in the yard. Sure. Who cares if it gets a foot of snow and ice on it? it <laughs> That's does. how mine I mean, looks right now. It's got I mean, about a half a foot of snow you on You don't it. even have to cover it up. Just leave it out. I mean, it's super durable. So here's the two-tone, most limited we have only, seriously, we have only 200 left in this two-tone. This is the first time you've seen it this well, season. So, I, you know, I, I better hurry. take, I better take my two-tone because yeah. they're moving, going fast, I understand. Yeah. But again, this weighs almost 40 pounds. I can pick it up. So oh, you good can easily pull it around, pick it up, move it around. But yet it holds 800 pounds. Carolyn, we've had phone calls, though, where people put these in the back of the SUV. I've done it. Mm -hmm. Take it to if you're going to have a 4th of July parade. Don't forget those kids' soccer games that start at 8 in the morning yeah. and start when the sun goes down. Yeah. You have somewhere to sit down, maybe take a book with you, mm -hmm. and when the kids nice come in that want a snack, you flip it up, let them have their snack on the converter bench. This is the tan, so two-tone over there, tan right here, solid white in the front. That's what we have at our house. Let's say hi to Marianne in West Virginia. Hello, Marianne. Well, good morning. How are you? I am just wonderful. Good. I hear you have one of these. Is that right? Yes, I do. Okay. I had it. I started using it at the beginning of last, well, actually last spring. Okay. Um, I started out putting my plants up in the front porch to get them started. So then after we got those started, we moved to the backyard and when we have fires, um, my little grandson, he loves to lay down and fall asleep on his pappy's lap on that picnic Aww. bench out back. It is, it's very easy and like you say, versatile. I've only got one, mm -hmm. but he flips it up when we have sometimes <laughs> the fires and him and his two little friends will sit there in color How while adorable. the adults are in the swings or whatever. So it's easy to take care of. You just wipe it off. Like you said, there's no painting. Yeah. Um, yeah. We actually brought it in this, this fall winter and use it in the basement when we had a little well, party in the that's house. That's a great idea. There you go. Yeah. So it's very, very versatile, very easy to use. And I mow the grass and I pull this thing <laughs> and it's very easy to move. Thank Good. you, Marianne. I, you know, I want everybody to see too, cause you've just got the one. I'm leaning as hard as I can on this side and it's not tipping over. Um, no, and Jeff, stand and up. Exactly. Yeah, I try just to look, you, I you want me to get out of here? Is that what you're saying? I'm pushing here. No, I'm just pushing here. <laughs> I just want everyone to know it's balanced. For the, yeah, you know, for the little tip. kids to press on it, even though oh, you sure. only have the one half of exactly. the table. But, you know, if you want to make the whole picnic table, then you just get two. It's a hundred pound I know, limit I on the top. I keep thinking of that. Yeah. Well, you know, and the, well, that's totally up to you. But, um, you know, I think that it's, it's just a really great piece of furniture either way. It is. Well, thank you for letting us know how much you're enjoying it, Marianne. Well, you have a great afternoon. You as well. Take, take care, honey. Bye-bye. Thank you. That was one of the sweetest stories ever. I know. The, the they're two all kids cuddling all the little kids by the fire. here and falling asleep on Pappy's lap. What we've done right How here, cute. though, you don't have this. This is half of a picnic table. Yeah. The other half, we have the backup. So if you wanted to eat, so you I can know sit picnic just table like has a back on it. Think I about know, it. Oh, look at that. And then maybe the kids come on this side and eat yeah. while you have the back to relax right. on. Right. That's fantastic. Because even if you only have this much width, yep. it's enough room for people to eat across from each Absolutely. other. Absolutely. And then, you, again, you, you can make it just into more seating. And then you have you a conversation. To area and, and you sit with it's your friends just tonight the best and I'm telling you you will <laughs> not have a hassle um, putting it together you absolutely won't and you can if you want to go through customer reviews and just look how many of them actually mention that oh my gosh it was so easy to put together yeah um, two tones sold out
Well, you know what? Goodbye, Two Tone. I mean, too bad. I'm I so sorry, but I mean, it's just. I, hope, I don't know if we're going to get any more. Not probably in the next couple of weeks. So check back later in the season if you I, want that. I'm just showing you the stability again. It's about the construction. There's science in this. This is something that is stable. Mm -hmm. It's not going to flip over. Right. You can put it right there. You can put it. That could be muddy ground. It's not going to dig in. That's the beauty of the converted bench. It originally was made out of redwood. But there were problems with redwood. There was problems with, with splinters. And then still having to stain it or do something to it in the off season. So instead we make it out of this polyvinyl, which wears like iron. It's actually better than having wood or steel. Awesome. So again, here's the white. This is what the one that started it all. Yep. Last year we brought in two additional colors. The two-tone is sold out, but we do still have that tan if you want that one, which is, you can see it right back here with my hand on it if you want the tan. Uh, the tan is now the most limited. If you want the white, it's just pristine. If you have that, you know, sort of Pennsylvania farmhouse style with the, we have a lot of white trim. It, All the trim in our house is white. Uh, we've got a lot of white other furniture and stuff. So I thought the white would be perfect for our yard. But the tan is very neutral. So it also absolutely. works with any color of uh, patio umbrella or if you want to put an umbrella over it or put throw some cushions on it you can by the way it's super comfortable all by itself you know it really is that's the other thing it does have a little give to it you'll even see when mm -hmm. I stand a little bit of a bend that's what you want it's yeah. not rigid where you say man that is the most uncomfortable thing I ever sat on yeah that little bit of give makes it really easy and again if there's anything that gets on it you're just gonna take a rag and wipe it up I can't find my ketchup and mustard at the moment but if I could I would show you that. Each, each one of these benches holds 800 pounds. Easy assembly. You never need to paint it or do anything else to it. It's super durable. You can leave it outside in the inclement weather or all winter if you don't have a place to store it. It, it will look just like this. You know, maybe just wipe it down. It'll look just like this, ready to go for this coming warm season. And again, so. the assembly you mentioned, it's so easy. The sides, put these panels in, the one on the bottom and then there's just four bolts and you're done. It's literally five to eight minutes and you do it once and forget it, you're done. A lot and of it you will fit taking, in the back of your SUV. I know, and take it with you. A lot of you are taking advantage of uh, picking up more than one while we have your color available. So if you want the full picnic table, order two of these and then you'll have two benches as well when you're not using it as a table. All right, tan again is now the more limited option. Over 1,600 have been ordered. Stay on the lines for our converter bench. Thank you, Jeff. What Carolyn, a great it product. It's so great to see you. It's spring is here. When I see you, spring is here. Oh, thank you, ditto. You're and absolutely. You've got that fabulous rug coming up later in the show as well. All right, it's time for the first presentation of our today's show. We are going to get over. <laughs> Where am I going? Am I going right here? Where am I? <laughs> All right, uh, here we go. <laughs> I'm gonna stand behind these guys. Um, we have, from Plow and Hearth, the most amazing offer for you today as part of our gardening event. When we thought, what can we have as a today's special value for our really, we had one event already, but this is really the big event of the heading into spring weeks today. So we thought, hmm, Plow and Hearth, absolutely.